Hello everyone, this is King and welcome back to our Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Let's Play. This is episode 10. In the previous episode, we continued the main story quest. We completed a few side quests, sent off some allies, helped a few friends, killed some vaults, unlocked a few features in the game, and I believe that was it. We did discover um, we had a few collectability items to input, but we will be doing that on this episode. So this episode we'll be continuing the main story quest, we'll be doing some exploration, but before we do all that we are going to look at our stats and see if we can finish any of the Collectopedia items. Alright, let's get to it. Let's see. What do we got? Is it under quest? It is. So do we just hold A? Okay. Plus 30 infinity? Beast Fang. Okay, so this is going to give us so much infinity. This is great. Let's um... Let's see what our affinity is at right now, which is really nice. It is um, uh, five eighths of the way there, I believe. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, five eighths, yep. So we have five eighths of the clock filled. Let's see if we complete this Collectopedia, see how full it will get. Let's go over here. That's all, of them. all right, Ellis, you have plus six, is That's not too much. Them. You should, it's only plus six affinity. That's not really, not really That's beneficial, all. honestly. Yikes. I thought it'd be more higher than that. Maybe if we go lower? No. We don't have everything here. Plus six affinity. We have everything here. Black mask. We'll check out the um, equipment after we see if we can... After we turn in all the Collectopedia stuff that we can turn in. Okay. Here you go, Fox. Trish. Attack stone. We don't need that. Tool belt. I don't know if we need that or not. We just had to persevere. Plus six affinity. We just had to persevere. Thanks. Now to crack on. Oh, it's um Harla. Trish, I know you from somewhere, Trish. I just don't know exactly where. What are there NPCs that rename each other? No. Okay, so it was Trish? She was the defender. Her name was Trish, right? Ah, that's so confusing. Because this girl's name is Trish, but the last Trish we saw had yellow wings. This girl has black wings. What is going on? There's just more than one Trish. It's looking complete. Apprentice fan brace? Does that mean I get more accuracy? You know I'm a fan of accuracy. You know I'm a fan of accuracy. Friendship ring? I believe that's um, more HP when you revive or... Something like that. It's it's good for um, uni if I plan on dying a lot. But as a good Let's Play content creator once said in a Xenoblade Chronicles game, I am not going to revolve my parties around dying. So it's not of any use to me. Okay, let's go. Are we all rank 10? Yeah. Uni, what are you at? You are at 68 healing power. So you got a plus 8 healing. Nice. Um... You should be doing what you had with, um, actually, no, no new skills though. We, you will be doing what we had with the other accessories. I think it was, um, reduce aggro generation from healing arts by 20%. We don't need that. We don't have an issue with aggro right now. Boost damage dealt when attacking higher level enemies by 25%. Oh, right, right. Okay. That's useful, but not something I would want to sacrifice my, um, you know, limited accessory slot for. At least not in this case. Boost damage dealt by machines. Nope. Boost damage dealt by terrestrial life. Boost damage dealt when attacking enemies targeting you by 16% of lance. Okay. I can look into that later. Boost damage. Let's see. Aquatic. Boost amount of HP healed from using healing arts by 11%. Is that the harvest? It's only 11%? What? Boost amount of HP healed from using healing arts by 11%. So that's like additional 10. If I heal for 50, I get what? 55 and then 100, I get 110 or 111 100, and then 56, 106. Uh, no, where I can just get a 10% chance to. This is like the only thing I think I got from the expansion pass that I <laughs> I compare to everything. I was like, no, it's not, it's not, it's not as good as this. No pawn strap. Boost auto attack by 58%. Again, not something we need. Dexterity 21% is a must, but not for Uni. She's main focus is going to be healing anyways. 
unless you can miss a heal, which I've never seen before. Again, we don't have the ability to swap characters, so there's no way for me to know. Um, Grants of Veil, let's see. Is there anything I need to look at? No pawn strap. Reduce aggro towards self by 5% when auto attack hits. When your attacks are blocked, you are not... Well, these are, like I said, such situations. We already went over that in a future... In a, in a previous video, so we're not going to do that. I think everything's fine, um, except for the attack. So if we look at this, sorry, let's go to accessories. Silver, bat, silver boost attack by 25%. And the other one is, was it? Here we go. Nope, that's not it. Where is it? I think it's back up here, maybe. Boost damage dealt when attacking higher level. And right now, we are not attacking higher level enemies. Either we are the same level or just a little bit higher. So maybe whenever I'm fighting a boss, that'll be a good idea. But then again, I don't know if 25% is worth the you know downgrade to to the attack from 70 to 90. So I just don't know. Um, let's see. Well, Silver Bell boost attacks already by 25%, so honestly, this is mute. The Apprentice Vanbury sucks. Wait, boost damage dealt though, but a boost attack. Let me, let me look real quick. So if his damage is 73 and you have a 300% multiplier, it's 219. And you're going to times that by 25%, well, no, no, 219, right? Okay, if it's down to 73, so 73 times 300%. Two nine. Wait, what? Ninety-one times three hundred percent is two seventy-three. So, nineteen twenty-five, six, seven, nine, nineteen twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, fifty. And you at two nineteen times twenty-five percent. Fifty. It's the same. It's the same number. It's, it's fifty-four versus fifty. I'm not going to do that. No. Dexterity. I wish I had a better rainbow gloves. Do I? Do I don't boost dexterity. I do. What? But it's only one percent. It doesn't increase my my thing at all. That's crazy. I'm still gonna take it though. Let's see. Do I have a better silver silver belt? I can do it by alphabet. So let's go name. Silver. It's gonna be all the way down here. S. Nope, it's the only one I got. Can I equip you with anything? Nope. Useless Wamba. Alright, but we are level 10 now. Okay. Well. Sorry. We got the Collectopedia stuff done, right? At least as much as we possibly can at this very moment. Yeah, we can't really do anything here. And I don't know what rank the Collectopedia is either, so I don't know. Oh, I just need additional blue chain. Okay, I can just keep on looking for it. Let's see. I'm not going to be using a no pawn coin unless I absolutely have to, so just, uh, just FYI. It is a rare resource, and I do have a lot of it thanks to the expansion pass, but I'm still not going to um, like take advantage of it. I think I'm just going to use it for something else. Um, later down the line let's see we're gonna, just gonna save here it's good to keep a record training drills let's see items I don't know if... let's just do a clear pass just in case there we go so we're gonna at least have an idea where we're going okay that's done only a third of the video in but it's not too bad we at least got some things done and we were able to finish a lot of the collectopedia we went nothing up in the flame clock we are still what five eighths of the way up there one two three four five yeah five eighths yeah it didn't change much but what can you do does your stats reflect like for the flame clock yes he's 91 what no way so is my stats increasing because of the flame clock, not because of my level? Wow. 
Yeah, it is. I think it. I think it is. Anyways, I'll I'll try to pay more attention later. Later, or I'll just review the video at a later date. Okay, story progression. Let's go. Oh, this is red. Nice. Do I need to um I need to send him off? But is he in the way or there's a little un little cave there? But I'm not gonna try to pursue that. They're double my level. And then, here we go, story quest. I thought this was a commentary dialogue. Well, I mean, I thought this was a voiced cutscene. Rendezvous point up ahead. Since Snowball can't use irises, isn't it a pain to have keep, uh, have to keep fiddling with the terminal? No fear, Rico take it in stride. Also, if pretend to not look at terminal, can ignore all sorts of troublesome and tiresome communications. Whoa, that's kind of smart. Riku, watch out! All right, let's get it. It was clam it was camouflaged as a rock. We're gonna have to face it. Here it comes. Let's go. All right, guy. So we got that back attack going. Get that side attack. I didn't miss, and it was a side attack. Oh, it was the AOA one. Okay, this one is it. Here we go. I like the dash. It's, it's a nice feature. It, it, I need to use it more, but it's definitely a lot better. And Xenoblade 2, it was, I think that's what they, they learned from their mistakes, and they just, honestly, they're doing a great job. And Lance is going to die. He's poisoned? That's unfortunate. There you go. Well, Uni's dead. There we go. Can I go with the topple, maybe? Let's get the topple here. There we go. This is the best it's gonna get. I don't think we're gonna win this. Yeah. Yep. That, that's not gonna happen. Two thirty. Okay, that's weird. Um, yeah, I'm done. Can I make it? Nope. Yeah, not gonna make. Oh, could I have dodged that? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know how <laughs> how I'm supposed to win that. Okay, let's try this again. Okay. Let's see. Let's go. There's some misses, so that's not bad. Oh, I can um I can restructure our arch to where it's actually like that where he'll miss. There we go. Uh, 
Oh, I, I messed up. I should have stayed in his back here. It's fine. There you go. We need that side break going on here. Hopefully, is he gonna aggro me? Nope. He's gonna aggro Uni. There we go. Get that back attack going. Okay. We're going to shoot for the overclock buster, so let's stay behind him and do that. Get to his side real quick. And three, two, one, let's get it. Top hole, days, there we go. Nice. A lot better than the first attempt. So, it's gonna be next month. Yeah, just a little longer. You're something else, Mwamba. The pride of Colony 9. Oh, you guys. Finally made it this far. What's up? Well, thing is, I was thinking after this op, I think I'm gonna go and put in a transfer to the Salvage Corps. You never know what will happen on the battlefield, right? You can laugh at me if you want. I ain't laughing, man. We've only been alive this long because you've always had our backs. Yep. We owe you a ton. Just make sure you get to your homecoming, okay? Lance. Uni. You guys. Mamba. Now not time to relax tear ducts. Let down guard, and you feel flame clock of someone else. Riku, come on. <laughs> well, you don't mince words. You are right, though. Sorry. No. Huh? Oh, no, it's not that. I guess I was just thinking about your homecoming. It made me feel a little sad. No. Mwamba, salvage is an important service. Don't feel like you owe us anything. Thank you so much, Noah. Right then. Let's get this operation done. Next month's a homecoming! I'd love to make it to my homecoming. Maybe if I'm lucky. <sighs> of course you'll make it. We all will. I wonder... I mean, I'm not like you guys. I'm so clumsy. Come on, you're not. What about the last match? You did way better than everyone else. We still lost though, right? It's okay. I've sort of half given up already. Joran? Well, at least... Huh? When I do die, I want to at least be of some use. Enough of that! What? Don't talk like that! I've always told you we're a team, haven't I? That means now and always. Oh. Noah. Noah. Huh? I'm gonna go on ahead. We got a call. Martha's team has a spot free, apparently. Oh, right. Do me a favor. Come along with me to the office. When you apply. Got it. The commander can be intense. Exactly. Later! All right, as we continue to Alfito Valley, let's see, we have a f some time, so let's see what we can do. Let's just continue the main story quest. We did really well during the second attempt to kill that enemy. I'm pretty proud. That overclock buster does so much damage, it's just so nutty. 2k? 
insane. I'm contemplating whether or not I should continue killing these trash mobs so I can keep my flame clock alive, but I don't know. It's kind of like, no, that's like the only real incentive, really. I'm not really incentivized to do so, but it, it gives the stats. The stats are so good. The stats are so good. A container. Okay, well, we can kill this really quickly. That's fine. Ground bait. Did we aggro the rest? We did. I want him to focus on this. There we go. There has been some times whenever aggro does break away, but it's not. It's not too bad, honestly. If we compare this to like Xenoblade 2, this is nothing. Can we get the days? Days, there we go, yep. Thank you. I, oh, my bad. This is a huge difference. It does like 100 versus 300 if I do the back attack. Do your positionals, folk. Do your positionals. It doesn't matter if it takes longer time. It's just the damage just 10 times night and day. Look. 289, that's 300. That's like literally three times the damage I would have done if I just. 168 break. Not, if I would have just not done my positionals, it just it's so worth it. It's so worth it. There we go. Let's go. You get that AoE? That's the first time we've seen Lance's ult. I believe so. At least either one of the few times we actually seen him. I never actually seen it. Consistently. Can we get that daze? Daze? Come on, uni. Uni. Dude. Yeah, I missed. God. See, this is exactly what I was talking about. It's exactly what I was talking about. That miss, though. God. Okay. Let's go here. We um we have done a lot in this episode. We've I got nothing bad to say. I mean that I knew that cutscene was coming up, but that mob did so much damage. I was not I was not ready for that. I wonder if anyone else has con came across that where they had to fight that mob and died several times. Can I I just, yeah, I had to zoom out. That was insane. What is that? Oh, this one's supposed to give you a lot of good stuff. Okay, can I just run away from this? Can I not? I mean, I guess I can fight it. This is just a bit annoying. Let's focus target. You get that side break, maybe? There we go. Get the back attack going. There we go. Back attack's coming up first, so we'll do that. Here you go. See, the arrow positionals is... I missed. It's the best thing, honestly. I don't have to look at the enemy to know whether I'm at the side or not. I just look at the arrow. And with small enemies like that, it's night and day difference. Like, look at that. See how the arrow changes constantly? It's just ridiculous. I always find it strange how this guy attacks with just one of his paws. He's like... You know, like an attempt to... <laughs> it's silly. Okay. Here we go. We're gonna dash into that AoE because it doesn't do anything. And I missed! Oh my goodness. But... Oh, it's Lance dead? Okay. It res for 185. We... I don't know if we'll survive this one, actually. Nope, Unis is dead. I won't get the top way either. 
What is with the Camille is doing so much damage though, honestly. Yeah, I'm out of here. I'm out. What are you doing? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna leave. My defense is down. There you go. What? Yeah, I thought I was running away, but okay. Well, did we really respawn that far away? That's no fun. Yeah, this is no joke, guys. This is actually pretty hard. And, and to be fair, we don't have our full party yet, and I think that's like one of the reasons why. This aggro system sucks. Look at all these mobs, man. Oh, I never sent that guy off. Okay. I can do that. That's one way to fill up the flame clock, you know? Okay, let's go. Will I get aggroed? Yeah. That's annoying. These little... These mobs are so annoying because they're so tiny. Right there. Okay, got it. What a way to go. Can you imagine just like dying off the beaten path and just never being found? Okay, we're gonna focus on this. Can we do the side attack here? Nope, that's a bag attack. Come on, dude. There we go. AoE? Let's go. 400. Was that me? a lot of damage we need that back here you go 300 it's not bad do I need to look at Lance's skills because he so far I don't know let's get that side break though get that back attack nice Yeah, so it is double. So Vortex is 68, 68. Got it. So that's like, what? 120, 130? 68, um, 16, 120, 136? Okay. Let's see. You know, I wish healing arts were just a little bit better, but I think it's designed for six players. That's why we're having such a hard time right now. Plus 20? Okay. Once we get closer to six eighths of the way there, I will t check out our stats and just be mindful of it. I'm going to try to stay away from the Camilles so far because they've been giving me a hard time and I just don't want to deal with that. It's just a little annoying. Am I going the right way by chance? This is why I hate that. Like I wish I can look at the minimap but because of the enemies aggroing you all the time sometimes. All the time, yeah. That's just annoying. Are you going to follow me all the way over here dude? You're joking, right? Oh my god. It's okay. It's okay. We can just ignore you. We're, we're, we're busy collecting stuff. We don't have time for you, sir. Are you still following me? Jesus. Gee, oh my god. Look, the moment I'm free into another one? Ridiculous. Come on, mate. Just want to collect stuff. Leave me alone. Thank you. All right. Um, is there something to collect over there? There was a chest. Okay, I see. Did I collect it? I think I collected already. Yeah, I don't need to go over there. Let's check the map real quick. Real quick. Um. I don't think we can go there right now, it's just higher ele elevation, so we're forced to go over here. But, um, I think there's an objective, yeah, over there. I'm going to actually end it right here. We're coming up on that 30 minute marker right now. 
So in the next episode, we are actually going to go to that quest objective marker. That's going to be the um, Alfito Valley, I believe. Um, so far, we've done a lot. Um, I don't expect us to do. I really don't know what's going to happen after this. So we're just going to try to progress into the main story. If we see a village, we'll we'll go from there. And um, as far as I know, we're just going to continue trying to progress the main story. That's the goal, anyways. 